x to the 0 plus 5x to the 1 plus 25x squared plus 125x cubed. Okay? And it's generating it's generating function. Where's that gone to? If I can just find it there. Just did it a moment ago. Um, it's generating function uh, is, let's say, for g5. Okay? So let's say for our g, g for 5 of x was 1 over 1 minus 5x. But what we want to do is we want to introduce a zero between terms, okay? And we know how to introduce a single zero between terms because we had a look at that, we had a look at that earlier on. To introduce a single zero between terms, what we do is we substitute in an x squared. So if we let x equal x squared in this particular sequence here, okay? So if we take this sequence here now and let x equal x squared, what we end up with is x squared to the zero plus five x squared to the one plus 25 x squared squared plus 125 x squared cubed and so on dot, dot, dot. which is effectively x squared two times zero gives that's x to the zero plus two times one gives us one so that's x squared that's five x squared plus 25 two times two is four 25 x to the four plus 2 times 3 is 6, 125x to the 6, and so on, which is what we require. This is encoding, <clears throat> this is encoding 1, 0, because there's no x to the 1, uh, 5, there's no x to the 3, so there's 0, there's 25x to the 4, there's no x to the 5, there's 125x to the 6, and so on. So what we need to do is we need to take the generating function, this generating function, and substitute in for x, x squared. So we end up with this generating function is going to be equal to 1 over 1 minus 5. Substituting x for x, x squared, that gives us x squared, which is exactly what we required. And then the final sequence uh, that we are going to consider, or that we're considering here, okay, the final sequence, e, uh, d, that should have been e, okay, and the final sequence, which is sequence, sequence f, so sequence f, I can just find it there, is 0, 1, 0, 0, 2, 0, 0, 3, 0, 0, 4, dot, dot, dot. Okay? So what we look at first of all is that we have the natural numbers in here. Okay? 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay? So we have the sequence 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay? And it has a power series, x to the 0 plus x to the 1 plus x to the 2 plus x cubed. <clears throat> oh, sorry. 1x to the 0 plus 2x to the 1 plus 3x squared plus 4x cubed and so on. Okay. And now I want to introduce, let's ignore this leading 0 here. If I want to introduce two zeros between terms, well, to introduce one 0, I substitute an x squared. And we've seen earlier to introduce two zeros, I substitute an x cubed. So if I let x be x cubed, this now becomes x to the zero plus two times x cubed to the one plus three times x cubed squared plus four times x cubed to the cubed to the cube uh, and so on, which effectively has given us x to the zero plus two x cubed plus three x uh, 3 times 2 is 6, 3 times 3 is 9, so that's 4x to the 9, and so on. And you can see the missing terms, there's no x to the 1, there's no x to the 2, we have the 2x cubed here, there's no x to the 4, there's no x to the 5, we have the 3x to the 6, and so on. But this is now encoding 1, 0, 0, 2, 0, 0, 3, 0, 0, 4, and so on. Mm -hmm. So if we take the generating function for the naturals, so the generating function for the naturals uh, is equal to 1 over 1 minus x squared. And if we substitute in for x, x cubed, we'll get the generating function that have, for the naturals that have two zeros between each term. So if we let x equal x cubed, we now end up with uh, g of the naturals with x cubed. Uh, is 1 over 1 minus, well, the x becomes x cubed squared. Okay? 
But we don't want this. We want this thing shifted by a zero. And we know how to do that. If we multiply it by an X, so if we take this power series here, and if we multiply it by an X, okay, we end up with, well, the X to the zero becomes an X to the one. The, the zero of them, so just just look at, let's just look at the ones that aren't zero for a moment, so ignore them. X times two X cubed gives us plus two X to the four. X times, ignore them. Uh, X times three X to the six gives us plus three X to the seven and so on. So the terms that are missing, we're missing an, an X to the zero. We're also missing in here the X to the two and also the x to the three. We're missing inside here the x to the five and the x to the six. Okay? So effectively what we have is zero, one, zero, zero, two, zero, zero, three. The two things that are missing are zero, zeros. So we should take this generate function now and multiply it by an x. So x times this gn of x cubed, it's a funny way to encode this. So we're multiplying this by an x, which gives us an x over one minus x cubed squared, which is now this new generating function for this sequence, where the natural numbers between each term, we have two zeros, but more importantly, it has a leading zero at the start. So there was three important points in relation to these examples. First of all, to introduce a zero, you multiply your, your generating function by an x. If you have a base generating function, to introduce two zeros at the start, you multiply by an x squared. To introduce three zeros, you multiply by an x cubed, and so on. To introduce between terms a zero, you substitute in an x squared. To introduce two zeros, you substitute in an x cubed. To introduce three zeros, you substitute in an x to the four. Okay? Uh, to, to, to make something alternate between positives and negatives, you substitute in a negative x or the appropriate multiple of a negative x, depending on what the original, what the original sequence, what the original sequence was. Okay. Okay, guys, uh, once again, uh, this is Jonathan Lambert uh, uh, with Maths and Stats. And I hope that this particular video, uh, another video in our series of videos dealing with generating functions. Uh, I hope that this video, we had a fair few examples in this video. It was quite long, this video. It was about 45 minutes. I will break it up into individual individual components. I hope that this video was in some way intuitive. And more importantly, I hope that was helpful for you. And thanks for watching. Okay. Oh, please subscribe. Bye-bye. Okay.